hi guys and welcome back to another renovating video i am so sick and tired of this bed at this point it took me a whole three weeks to get this bed to be properly dried out and finally it is dry and look how clean it is oh my goodness it literally looks like a new bed um i'm so happy with the way that it turned out but it was such a pain to get it to dry we had to use fans we had to take it outside in the sun every day and use fans and hair dryers and heaters i was about to give up on this bed you guys i was about to say mm -mm, how much is a new bed i'm just gonna buy myself a new bed i can't deal with this it's not getting dry uh but yeah just be careful of that if you're in swap up and you're gonna wash your bed it might take very long to dry especially if it's like not summer or east weather and then but i'm loving the way that the tiles turned out you guys and it's so cute i mean i was just setting up the bed here trying to get a like an after photo and willow was just she was just having it she was just having the best time of her life playing on the bed jumping on the bed just being a girl you know but if you're new to my channel hi my name is gabby i make content of my daily life lifestyle vlogs um sometimes cook with me videos and sometimes travel vlogs and sometimes about my weight loss journey so if that interests you then do give me a follow subscribe to my channel also follow me on tiktok and for all of my returning subscribers those of you who always comment and uh, have nice things to say thank you so much i appreciate you guys and i love you guys a lot okay Excuse me. Wait. Willow, don't do that. I'm trying to make it. Willow, I said don't do that. Wait now. Thank you. And I also wanted to say thank you to all of you guys who really left me sweet comments on my previous video and gave me tips on what to do and how to improve my channel and how to try to get more views and things like that. But you guys, I just feel like everything that you guys are telling me, I have already done and I've already tried that. And at this point, oh, I'm just so exhausted and tired and demotivated. Like, there's so many amazing things I want to do. There's so many exciting videos that I want to film. Um, but I just feel like I'm just not getting the traction on my channel that I would like to get, you know? Um, I would love to film so many more videos. I've got so many ideas. And also... I don't have the time to film all the videos. I don't have the time to edit all the videos. I love YouTube so much and I love and I enjoy the process so much. But number one, I don't have the time. I work full time and then I still have to come take care of Willow when I get home from work. Um, and then I still need to try and get enough sleep. So when do I literally have time to edit and and film all of these ideas? And then when I don't have time to edit, my phone is just full of so many videos. And then I cannot film more videos and it's so frustrating. Um, so yeah, I, I really don't know where this is going to go. Um, like I said, these renovating videos might be some of my last videos. Um, I'm basically done now. Um, as you guys will see, I just have a headboard to make for my bed, like a baseboard or headboard, yeah, and then I need to paint that one um, cabinet white, which is the black one, I need to paint that white, uh, which you guys might see in a later vlog, um, so yeah, let me know if you guys are excited to see the final, final result after the headboard and the cabinet that I paint. Okay, so... For now, this is what we have. I still need to paint that white. So we're not all done yet, but this is for now. Are you gonna sit still? Close your boater.
Okay, quickly, I wanted to add this pack with me video in this section because I don't have any more clips for now about the renovating series. So I just wanted to show you guys what I'm packing for my trip. I've packed my brush and a comb and then obviously my edge brush as well. And then I had to take some conditioner, which I threw in this little travel size bottle. I have my face uh, wash and scrub, which I put in that bottle, my facial cleansing brush, and then I have my bikini trimmer slash shaver. I love this thing. I bought it at Clicks. It's so affordable um, and it works really well as well. Next up, we have my nail polish. I always have to pack my nail polish. And then I've got this container, which used to have body butter in, but now it has like my hair clips in, which I feel like I need to find a smaller container for my hair clips because I don't really have that many. Um, it's just basically the bobby pins that I need. Then this is my favorite deodorant. I use the Dove Original as well as the Dove Cucumber. I've got some body spray. And then this is my favorite dry body oil. It smells so good. Pomegranate granite and rose hip oil is my favorite scent from oh so heavenly as well as this oh so heavenly deeply detox hair fragrance spray i love that so much i always have to take earbuds and then i am using this organic hair growth oil from another youtuber who's in the uk and then my gel because i always need to gel my hair and then obviously toothpaste toothbrush i'm using this charcoal toothbrush i mean toothpaste at the moment which i'm really loving but it's so expensive my patches i always have to take my patches with this video was filmed a while ago when i was still using the updated version i'm not using that one anymore um, i still had some left with the little magnet in the middle i was showing you guys and then i still have these ones these were the updated version i didn't even finish using them i still have like a full set of the updated version i think um so yeah i just had to take my patches out of the box and pack those um then i also like to take these um little packets of wipes just in case i need that and then i also have to take my sanitary products although i'm not getting my period these days because i am on or I was on contraceptive. My period hasn't come back yet, but I just take them just in case. Next up, we got the suitcase. So I packed two sets of pajamas and then I pack some cozy socks just in case it's cold. I pack my dress swimsuit and then my underwear obviously has to go with as well. This was just for one day trip, so I didn't really pack multiple bras. I just took the bra that I was gonna wear. I packed a little uh, tights and then two dresses to wear in the daytime just in case. And then I packed this um, pants and top for the office wear as an option and then I packed a black dress for evening wear in case we go out for dinner and then another dress as a second option for office wear and then my Spanx and then that's basically all the clothes that I brought um, I was literally just going for one day so oh I forgot my little jersey that I like to wear with my evening dresses so yeah I just had to pack that in quickly and then these are the shoes some sandals some flip-flops and tackies um, and then my toiletries that you guys saw me pack earlier so and that was basically it you guys I didn't take a towel because um, most guest houses B&B's they have towels for you so I didn't need to take a towel and then I just took my travel pillow and then my shoes that I was going to wear the next day I wasn't driving so I could wear flip-flops normally if I drive I wear boots um, and then a bras, my Spanx, and my dress. And then you guys saw that I filmed this trip on YouTube. If you haven't seen it, go check it out. It's up.